Here's a question that I know is on the minds of a lot of pregnant women. I know my daughter, when she was pregnant, my first grandchild is only about 10 weeks old at this point. Uh, my daughter would be so careful in everything she would eat, in everything that she would do. So this question here is, is it safe to get dental work while I'm pregnant? So obviously because you're pregnant, there are things we need to avoid. But if uh, dental work needs to be done, we take all the precautions to avoid, uh, for example, x-rays or uh, any, oh, yes. any elective work that, that needs to be done. We do avoid it, but prevention is, is always um, is, is really minimally uh, invasive. Um, and uh, uh, the goal here is to prevent something that could affect your baby. So sometimes there's no choice. If, if you, you have an abscess, it needs to be treated. Right. Sometimes even x-rays need to be taken. So we, we have to weigh the, the benefits versus the risk of getting treatment done. And that's why prevention is even more important. Uh, we, we absolutely need to avoid being in a situation where we have no choice. And clearly, right. if we even think you're pregnant, you should mention this to your dentist to take extra precautions yes. if yes. some work is needed at that time yes. to make sure that it's safe. Yes. Well, so the question we're looking at is, is it safe to get dental work done when you're pregnant? I guess the alternative question is, is it safe not to, you know, uh, get dental work done when, you, when you're pregnant? I mean, um, there I think again, you know, um, weighing the risk versus the benefit, um, you know, most uh, dental treatment it will be safe. Most of, you know, non-invasive one will, will be safe and we do take a precaution to, um, in, in planning the treatment to make it as safe as possible for um, the pregnant um, woman. Um, but if you don't get the treatment and it leads to worse complication, like abscess, you need a root canal, then you, you start requiring more invasive treatment and this is when, you know, it becomes less safe. Mm -hmm. um, so, you know, definitely we will make it as safe as possible, but again, try to prevent things before they, they become worse is always the best um, route to take. And, and you, that's, I guess, the importance of why you've helped me understand that that second trimester is so important because yes. you're preventing a problem from becoming yes. more manifest in that third trimester where it's going to be much but more look difficult. Look at it, it's best to get a spilling done than a root canal. Right, because I might need anesthesia we'll at that see, point and that's going to be we'll very see complicated. see if you're pregnant. Um, you know, it becomes even more important that you avoid all these more, you know, major treatment. But if it gets to the point where you need it, um, you should get it done to avoid like infection, um, mm -hmm. because infection could affect your overall health and right. health of the baby as well. Great.